Good evening. The state television company in Western Armenia represents the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. Evolution in mentalities in Eastern Armenia. Armenia records 966 confirmed coronavirus cases. Citizens isolated in Artsakh have no symptoms of a new coronavirus infection. A statue of the Hiti era confiscated in Harvard. All events dedicated to the April 24 in Los Angeles are cancelled. National Center of Chamber Music to present committee Das Berlin Liturgy online on Easter. With the April 24th, the National Day of Commemoration of the Genocide Against Armenians approaching, the Genocide Memory Center Institute of Yerevan urged all Armenians and friends of Armenia around the world to pay tribute to the innocent victims of the tragedy on Facebook. The public post made on Facebook page reads, The citizens of the Republic of Armenia and Armenians all over the world will commemorate the 105th year in memory of the Armenian victims. Along with Armenians, friends of the Armenian people from all corners of the world will also commemorate the Armenian victims. For a long time, the genocide against Armenians has moved beyond the boundaries of the ethnic memory, not being viewed as a crime committed against Armenians and a purely Armenian tragedy any longer. It is also a universal tragedy, one of the greatest crimes committed against humanity. Regardless of the actual situation in the country on April 24, regardless of whether the restrictions on the movement of people will be enforced on the day due to the health and safety concerns, we call for remembering and paying homage to the genocide against Armenians' victims, survivors and resistors using the opportunities provided by the Internet. We call on all citizens of Armenia, all our compatriots and friends of the Armenian people to replace their Facebook profile pictures on April 24 with photos of their relatives who fell victim to or survived the genocide in a frame designed to the purpose. In the absence of photos, write their names and surnames and their brief stories. In case you have no genocide victim or survivor relative, upload photos of Western Armenian intellectuals who were victims of genocide, public and political figures, freedom fighters, soldiers and commanders. Add in the simple hashtag I remember in Eastern Armenian or Western Armenian. You can find the whole article on our website. The number of coronavirus cases in Armenia grew by 26 in the past 24 hours, reaching 966, the Center of Control and Prevention of Diseases reports. According to the center, a total of 173 patients have recovered. 780 are getting treatment. The death toll from coronavirus in Armenia reached 13. The Ministry of Health of the Republic of Artsakh informs that the health condition of one of the five citizens infected with the new coronavirus is assessed as moderate, as he has other diseases too. The health of others is assessed as satisfactory. Nine isolated citizens have no symptoms of a new coronavirus infection. A sample of nine citizens in contact with him was taken for testing. The results will be announced later. According to the information received, the special detachment of the police conducted an investigation into the smuggling of historical artifacts. As a result, information was obtained about the suspects who were looking for a buyer to sell the antique item. Police officers acted as buyers and arrested the criminals at the time of the crime. It is reported that a lawsuit has been filed against the two arrested suspects. After careful concentration of the coronavirus pandemic, the United Armenian Council of Los Angeles, the Unified Young Armenians and the Genocide Against Armenians Committee have decided to suspend all of their April 24 commemoration-related activities. The coalition of these three community organizations are in charge of the requiem service at the Genocide Against Armenians Martyrs Monument in Montebello, the march in the Little Armenian Hollywood, and the protest demonstrations in front of the Los Angeles Turkish Consulate. The coalition made this decision not only as a moral responsibility to stand with the people of Los Angeles and the world, but also comply with the health directives imposed by the local authorities, which are meant to mitigate the spread of the coronavirus and to save lives. The National Center of Chamber Music will present parts from Comitas Berlin Liturgy performed by the Yerevan State Chamber Choir on its official Facebook page on Easter, headed by artistic director and conductor Harutun Topikan. The online broadcast will be available on April 12th at half past 8 p.m. It all started when Comitas received a scholarship to study in Berlin in 1896 from Alexander Montaschens. He studied philosophy at Friedrich Wilhelm University and at the private conservatory of Professor Richard Schmidt. In the third year of the conservatory, he wrote the famous Berlin Liturgy. The liturgy is one of the best works of Gomita's early period. Now let us represent to your attention a song by Bostan Ensemble. Oh, my God. 
can find the whole version of the song in the official page of Western Armenia TV. This was all for today. Goodbye.